students let us see what is there in this question four identical positive point charges of magnitude capital q are placed at the vertices of a square of side 2d what is the electric potential produced at the center of the square by the four charges so we are going to include all of the four charges now and we want to find the potential at the point c i'm just naming it as c like the center of the square so my dear students um, you must be knowing that the general formula for the potential due to a point charge so i must tell you this thing that this formula is applicable only on when we want to find the potential of potential due to point charges first of all or due to spherical conductor charged spherical conductor obviously the charge has to be there and if it is a spherical conductor we are going to use this formula if it is a point charge as given in our question we are going to use this formula now another thing that you must note here is that potential is a scalar quantity scalar quantity means that the potentials like they would be added because like first charge is casting v1 potential another is casting v2 then v3 and then v4 we are not going to use any vector phenomena here they are scalar quantities we are just going to add them like normal scalars so our answer for the total potential will be v1 plus v2 plus v3 plus v4 so this is the second thing that you need to note now the third point that we must be knowing before solving this question is that the positive source charge will create positive potential and negative source charge will create a negative potential so the potential will be positive if the source charge is positive so in our case all of the charges are positive so all would be casting positive potential and obviously when we are going to add them in a simple manner they will just add up and it will become a bigger value that's it and no negative charge it means that no potential is going to be subtracted my dear student this is really very important piece of information please note it down properly the negative source charge will be casting negative potential i have not written it in proper manner you 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 have to write it in the proper manner okay so v1 will be given by kq let us say this is the charge number 1 this is charge number 2 3 4 so this will be given by kq by r square where this distance is taken as r and the source charge is capital q as given in the question now the big thing is how to find the value of r in the terms of d because you have the answer in the terms of d so we have to find the value of r in the terms of d how can i find it well this is a square here and as we can see that r is basically half of the diagonal the length of the diagonal and it is a square so the length of a diagonal is directly it can be computed with the help of pythagoras theorem so you can do it by yourself i'm just taking the value directly so how does how the shortcut shortcut works like this is 2d and this is 2d so the diagonal is 2d multiplied by root 2 that's it that is a shortcut if you do not want it you have to apply the pythagoras theorem here and you can do your bit and you can find the value so the value of r will be half of this this 2 is cancelled so the r value will be this so now i'm going to find v1 it will be k q divided by r now v1 is equal to v2 is equal to v3 is equal to v4 if you want to find the total v that should be equal to 4 times v1 it means v total will be 4 times this so this can be written as 2 root 2 kq divided by d and hence d is the correct answer so this is the explanation for this question let us uh, see the answer once and uh, the answer is uh, yes according to the mark scheme also the answer given is d so this is how we solve this question my dear students all the best